Hey guys, welcome back to Cary Creek. I'm Jeremy here in Southern Ohio. Today we have a golf course project for you. No, you're not. You're going to work on the horse barn. I run my show, guys. Don't worry about it. I'm going to concede this match. We're going to Lowe's to buy horse barn stuff. We found the lights. Miss Kim has sent me direct instructions of which one she wants. We need four. They have three. Now we need to find one of those ladder things I found one way up top. I'm a professional ladder climber at Lowe's. We just gotta find one. For legal purposes, we can't show me climbing around like a monkey. I did get in trouble, but we got the goods. My wife had clear instructions to pick out flooring that was in stock. Well, guess what? Number one or number two are in stock. It's all special order stuff. Good job, Miss Kim. All right, here's the update. I can't get old Miss Kim because I've got to pick out four. We got to get this floor done, so I'm gonna pick it out. And I've got tons of options I'm choosing for. I can't remember her third, fourth, and fifth place often. Can you hear the frustration in my voice? I think you can. So I think I've got some picked out, and now I can't find nobody to load the stuff. So I'm gonna have to probably hijack a forklift. Want somebody to load me? I've got to do ten on the on the buggy here. But I'm gonna send Kim a picture of this and say I picked this out. That'll get her fired up. Might as well get some lunch. <laughs> Hot damn! An hour and forty-two minutes in and out of blows. We're on the road now. We're headed to Cairn Creek, guys. Eating some Pringles. <laughs> Cairn Creek, here we come. Come on. You want to know how bad that trip was to Lowe's? When I cashed out, there was a confusion there, but they charged me like a dollar sixty-five more per carton of that flooring. And she's like, oh, I'll get hold of somebody in flooring. Well, there's nobody in flooring. So it was like going to be seventy-five, eighty dollars something like that. I was like, let me tell you, we'll call this a win for the home team. I'm rolling out of Lowe's because, whoo, I didn't want to stay there no longer. Here's a scoop to wrap up this day. We got the floor done. I've got some corner pieces to go around that staircase. Got one more light to go up. One of the lights was all busted, missing parts had obviously been returned once. Uh, pretty productive day. This video is not quite even close to being over. We've got a whole weekend of activity going on, so stay tuned here. Let's take a peek. And I hit a home run on picking out the floor. She actually had a tear in her eye, maybe a couple. She was pretty pretty pumped up. She's really uh, proud of this this little area up here. The whole horse barn she's real proud of. And I'm glad to be able to do it for her, I guess. I always complain, but the end is near. The end is near when I get to go out and do other stuff and not worry about the horse barn, right? There's always gonna be something going on down here. I know it, I just know it. I feel it in my bones. We all know what it's like. Projects never stop. They just might get a little bit easier and the workload might just get a little bit farther apart. All right, guys, I'm actually going to a football game. Uh, Colby Oak, our second oldest son, is having a football game. So I'm wrapping up and that's where I'm heading to on this Friday night's Friday night football. Saturday morning, baby, live action. Karen Creek just got the fairway mode, golf green mode. Little cruises on his dirt bike. 
My old buddy Grady's up there splitting some firewood. He's a city boy. I'm going to try to turn him into a country boy. Come on. Good morning, guys. Three, two, one. Don't pet the sweaty thing. <laughs> no. No. If you're going to sweat, then you're going to pet. <laughs> I like to sweat the petty <laughs> And I like to pet. <laughs> this is not gonna work. He wants to be sweaty and petty. Oh. Don't sweat the petty things. Don't pet the sweaty things. I'm finally getting to get on my golf course project. Fairway extension, that's what we're heading to now. We gotta do some dozer work. And there's people down at Grubbyville talking in my video. Got little kids running around, heathens, guys down there with their shirts off. Never a dull moment on Sunday morning here at Cannon Creek. We've got the dozer out, we've got a Harley rake, we've got a disc again. This video started with me at Lowe's getting in trouble. Finally, where I wanted to start this video. What a video it's been. Getting that floor done. The horse barn, the upstairs, is all wrapped up. It feels really good to kind of be out. Now it's up to her to do some decorating, packing stuff in there, making it her little empire. Sunday fun day, fairway extension project let's go let's talk about what i'm doing right now so we dissed this thing up uh last week midweek we dissed it up we've done it twice we're gonna go for a third time it's dried back out finally we did get some rain we got that stuff really really worked in that dirt i wanted to build a mound down here to shelter this creek but i don't want to rob all my good top so i've got some pretty good top so up top here so i don't want to push it down just to build this mound so i've decided we're just gonna disc this, and, and here's the process. We'll disc it a couple times. The dozer, I'm only using that just to correct some drainage issues. Not moving a lot of dirt on this fairway extension. The dozer is just roughed in. The disc fluffs it up again, and then we've got a Harley rake. We're gonna Harley rake over it, and you're gonna see what that thing does. That thing is fantastic. It's really cool what that Harley rake will do, what kind of a surface it'll have us prepared to put that seat on. Uh, very, very handy. Grubby's in the tractor. Sunday fun day, we got some folks doing side by sides. We got heathens running around up at the mill shop. Beautiful day here in Southern High. I can't read. We've got this ready to receive our Titan Tall Fescue grass seed. Right now it's pretty windy. If you can see the golf flag on the green back there, it's whipping pretty good. This hollow just is like a wind tunnel. So I'm going to probably have to wait to get that seed down when the wind stops. I can get more consistent coverage. We're not going to get the straw done. It's uh, it's already 6.30 or so, 7 o'clock Sunday night. So the straw's not going to happen tonight, but it's key for us to get this seed down tonight though. just said over and out on a phone call. <laughs> that could have been the video ending. Oh, beautiful four spacious guys. Alright, we got that seat all down. The fairway extension has seed. 
that was a lot of work to get that fairway extension done. We do got a lot of work putting that straw down. We're not going to do that in today's video, but we're going to get the straw down this week. It's a big weight off my shoulders to get all the seed down and get this done. We can see the fairway behind me here. It's looking fantastic. From the drone shot, it still looks pretty weak. At this angle, it looks good. So I'm, I'm proud of how the fairway is coming back around due to the armyworm damage. Another great weekend out here at Cairn Creek. A nice episode for you guys. My hat's off, <laughs> my hat's off to you guys. We're almost at 3,000 subscribers here at Cairn Creek, our little channel, showcasing our homestead, what we do here, I guess future homestead. I always say that. Guys, thanks for watching. Thanks for working with us. Cairn Creek, over and out. <laughs>